Yo, how you doing? 18 July 2018. So today I want to show you how to create a green screen in your studio or in your house by yourself in just in 30 minutes. Today I decided to make a green screen in the studio. We need definitely a green screen in this studio to make some, you know, to make some funny videos because I really miss that thing. Remember, with the green screen you can create things like this. Or things like that. So it's actually kind of funny. Also, what I have to think about, what we have to take in consideration, the light, the light. Because when you have a green screen and you stay in front of the green screen, then you don't want to have any shadows of you. That is not bad. The light is over there, I guess, but it will look um, very stupid, you know, when we paint that wall into green. This is the entry, okay, when we just go in and we have a green stuff over there. I don't know, here in this space we have too much echo, but here we will not have too much echo, is I believe, what I believe, because it's a smaller area, the area is smaller. What about this wall? I can just, no, we have too much stuff in here. You know, there's too much stuff in there. So there is only one wall that we can use, which is that one. What about the, the lighting? Okay, that wall. But um, the problem could be, what about the, the floor in here? Looks a bit, you know, well, I don't know. It, it's, it looks okay to me. So I have a bit of a paint, some, um, not green, but I have turquoise. So it will be a turquoise that I've used for to create my artworks in here. And which is actually that one. Let's see if we have enough stuff. Yeah, there's definitely enough stuff. So we need uh, a brush and let me just uh, clean up this. Okay, I changed my decision. I'm gonna get off this installation, the AN, the alphabet. You can do it easily, see? I just taped them with, with simple stuff, so we're gonna talk about this later. I will install this installation right there, where I plan to make the green screen. I'm gonna paint this wall, you know, just like, like that, until here, and then, um, yeah, let's do this. Well, there, there are also other um, options how you can build a green screen, which is you can just buy, how you call that, something like a fabric. You know, it needs kind of, how you call that, like a tension. You know, it must be straight. Fabric in fabric, you have this waves and we have a bit of, you know, wind in the studio. It's not wind, but I don't know. We say Zug in German, you know, a seat, we say in German. I want to make, I want to paint it. That's why I'm gonna paint that definitely this place. Okay, I'm talking too much. Let's do this and have some fun. You know, normally it's almost impossible to move something like that by your own. And it's cool when you have this, you know, this little this wheel, which helps me a lot because of my back age. So now I will take, excuse me for this outfit by the way, it's I guess 40 degrees inside and I don't have any air conditioner. I will take this guy off. I'm not going to uh, install them right now over there. We're gonna do it tomorrow also. Simple as that. See, that's the point of, we say, taktisch in German. I don't know how to call it in English. It's just have everything simple, simple as possible. Well, it's helping me to save my time and to don't lose things. If I had right now a lot of, you know, like frames, then I would have a lot of nails or you know, screws in the wall and then I had to, you know, make renovations and stuff. No, we don't need it. It's just uh, this and this. I'm gonna show what kind of tape this is. This is the tape that I'm using for, you know, a lot of time. You can buy it online. I will put the description below if you like it you can just so it's like a fabric you know you can i usually use this uh, by making stencils you know it's holding everywhere and it's very strong i love the simplicity i'm in love with simplicity really that's it 
letters. Okay, I believe we can start off the paint, you know, the green screen thing. I don't know if I need any marks. I guess we do. How are we gonna do that? Um, I can use... I always get confused, you know, we say Bleistift in German. How do you call it in English? There's pen, there's pencil, there's some other stuff. This is just, you know, what you... You know how it works, so I will try to. That's even too much. How are we gonna? I have no clue. Okay, this is important. That shadow, we don't want that. So we need to start in here. Let's put something like, okay, like that. Well, I guess we need more. What about 15? It is the color will change when you have a shadow. Then we will have this green and that green, so the green screen will not work perfectly. I'm not a filmmaker, I just... Okay, 50, one more, 15 here, and one more 15. Then what about the, the height? Is that good? Okay, how much is it? Okay, that will be... Okay, that will another, another 60, I mean, put another here. I'm just marking, okay? That's 110. One more, 110. Okay. Now I will find a ruler. Okay. A ruler. Cool. I'm gonna use that one. It's um, a cardboard. I was, I guess it was a framing thing for me. Okay, I'm gonna use this directly. So it will go like, like that. Okay. And then one more. We are almost done with the marking because we don't want to paint walls that we don't need this is why the stuff is for it looks a bit weird but okay so i hope this is enough space i want to make anything wrong i don't know i know i'm not a professional so this starts here and it ends right there Let's start with the painting. I will put something on the floor. I don't want to have, you know, green dropping. I have some paper left from something, which I don't know. I also want to tape it. You know, it even holds on dusty floors. Impact. The paint, turquoise, I mean green. The only problem is we have only this one which is um, very small and it will take a bit of time um, but I can't go and buy another one you know, I just have this one so I'm gonna use it and you stay there okay, I'll be back So hot in here. That thing is almost done, and you might want, you might notice. See, hold on. I'm rolling the paint two times. No, if you can you see, looks like a lot of stripes over there. I don't know if you can see this, but this um, I painted for a second time. How you call that? I rolled that paint two times on the top till half and there I didn't. So the thing is, um, the best way is to roll that paint two times. Make the first one, wait and then go and roll it one more time. Then you will have this kind of, uh, that's not even green. It's almost green. It's turquoise. So let me just give it a try. Okay. Let me just give it a try like that. Um, Looks okay. Okay, what for is this green screen? Okay, I'm doing this for example, let's say, you know, my channel is about mosaic art and multi-layer stencil art the most, right? This is what I showed the most to you guys. With this, I can, I believe, I can do more. It's like I can tell about something. I can talk about, for example, mosaic art grouting and I can show at the same time the viewers, you know, in the same time. It's, it's more better because I can't show everything 
everything in a studio at that moment. So that's all. This is why you need a green screen. You will have two frames playing in the same time. Cool. There is one thing more that I want to share. And that is, see, we have this white, you know, a few white um, dots in here. So I will also try to turn them to green as much as I can because we don't want to have some white dots, you know. We will maybe have a better look with this. Do we have more? Yes, we have. We have one over here. Time that I've spent to create this green screen in total was 60 minutes. It's not bad. A brush, if possible, that one you can roll on the wall. And if possible, use a bigger one, not the one like that I've used. That's why it took 60 minutes. So let's try if it will work, I hope. Well, I do believe that it will work and I hope it will, really. Okay, let's go like this. Cool. Okay, now, please just get me back to the first week of July. What left from yesterday. Today I'm gonna spray paint the turntable right here. Oh, yeah, that's me making a stencil of Bruce Lee. But this is what we're gonna show at the next video. I'm gonna talk about how to create a multi-layered stencil. You know, a wall stencil, a big one. And how you're gonna do that, how to manage it, all things around that.